Ine-san is always there for me. Ryo-san, what were you talking about with Ine-san? Well... Is that a letter? In Chinese? Is it from the man who murdered Sensei? I don't know. Damn it! If only we knew someone who reads Chinese! Yeah, if only. Too bad we'll never know any Chinese people in here. In this, you know, town. Hi, Megumi. Hi, Adele. Hey, Adele. Chibi understands me when I talk to her. Whenever I call her, she answers me. Really? It's the truth. Right, Chibi? I told you. Wow, that's amazing. Are you cold? Chibi, are you cold? <laughs> You're so cute. Whoops. Oh yeah, I found a bunch of stuff. Last night, and a cutscene. So, I that cutscene trigger was completely yes, accidental. Like Every it. other time I play yeah, this game, it happens in the morning. If she eats. You're right. Thanks, you. But since I did that cutscene, I guess I can go talk to Chinese people now. Wait, isn't that guy Chinese? Son? You again. You always seem in good health. Yes. You take care that you don't catch cold. Health is the most important thing. You can't buy it with money. Do you, son? All now, right. Can I talk to you I about that? I take care of myself, but don't take your health for granted. It's not as easy to stay healthy as it may seem. You take care of yourself. Yes. All right, man. What's wrong? A man with sunglasses took oh, yeah, it's this one. Ball. He said he'd give it back if I brought you to him. What? Where is he? At the construction site. <sighs> All right. You. I knew you couldn't resist, boy. What? Remember the tattoo parlor? Payback time. Here, catch! 
go home. What? What? Fuck, man. Alright, give me out of this. Are you Chinese? Yes, my name's Shao Go. What's your name? Ryo. Ryo Hazuki. Ryo Hazuki. Yeah. Shen Shen Ryo Zan. Well, he's Chinese, so maybe we can ask him. If we ever see him again. Excuse me. Terribly sorry, but I just can't now. Ask someone else, I will just, you? I just can't, man. Life's too hard. Alright, so I'm still gonna go to the arcade, I think, at 3 p.m. Yeah? I think I still have to do that. I, uh, yeah, so until then, I'm gonna go talk to Chinese people about the letter. Excuse me. Hello, Ryo. Would you read this letter for me? I think it's in Chinese. Uh, hmm? What does it say? I'm sorry. I can't read it at all. There are so many strange too far away. you know? I see. So yeah, they can't read it apparently. So we need someone who's super good at Chinese. Do you have a minute? Sorry, but, um, uh, bye. <laughs> uh, bye. So remember that guy? who asked us for a drink that one time he uh... apparently he can read the letter so if we're, we ever see him again we could do that, or maybe because I said no that he's never gonna appear again who else was Chinese? I completely forgot oh yeah that restaurant uh... on the complete other side of town Yeah, alright. Still 10 or 11. Yeah, 
here, I think. Yeah. Tao-san, have you got a minute? Yes? What is it? I was wondering whether you could translate this letter for me. Oh no, there are a lot of old kanji characters. And it's written in an unusual way. What does it say? I'm sorry. I can't read it. Oh, really? What's the point right? of a written language if oh, you can't read it? yeah, really. But this kind of paper is used for ceremonial up, purposes in British. Chinese calligraphy. Ceremonial purposes? Tao-san, what ceremonial purposes? It's the top quality grade of paper. It's used for fine calligraphy. It's also used for ceremonial cooking. To wrap around sea bass, it's very famous. But you can't read it? No, we can't. Oh, but Guangxi might be able to. Huh? Ask Guangxi. He's out delivering yeah, that, on the, the shopping uh, street. Guy who's He's good for a with drink. kanji characters. I got it. I'll try him. So now that we have an ulterior motive, we can uh, we can get him a drink and not have to worry. Let's just wander around looking for him. Tatsumi-san. Hey, what's up? Got a minute? Come back later, this will you? Pink hair. I see. It's cool. It's Kanji Tatsumi. Isn't that his name, right? So I'm gonna hit up all the vendors. Oh, there he is! There he is! I can see him. Hmm. Hi. How's it going? What's wrong? I'm so thirsty. I Even if I bought a drink earlier, I'd have to buy him another one now, so change. it doesn't really matter. I just saved 100 yen. I'll buy pretty you much. One. What do you want? You're really nice. Thanks. What kind of drink do you recommend? Just tell me what you want, man. Mm. Fucking stop. Don't see. give me that responsibility. Fucking, I don't know, jet cola in the middle. Okay, come on. Hmm. Here. Thanks a lot. You've made my day. Can I ask a favor? Yes. Can you translate this letter for me? Oh. These kanji are weird. I can't read them. Really? I'm sorry. It's okay. I just wasted a hundred yen. Wait! My Japanese teacher's a kanji expert. Show her it. What's her name? Xiao Shi, yeah. She sells antique dishes at her china shop. Xiao Shu Yu at the china shop. Chinese yes. person at a china shop. I'll ask her. Thanks. Okay, I've got to go. Got things to do. Thanks for the drink. So yeah, if we, if we talked okay. to that kid again, he would have told us about that woman because she's his grandmother. And we would have saved 100 yen, so maybe that would have been better. But I didn't see him at the time. Wait, is this it? Yeah, here we go. May I help you?
Excuse me, are you Xiaosun? Yes, that's right. And you are? I'm Ryo Hazuki. Ah, uh, Hazuki-san? Oh yes, my grandson. Go and told me. Thank you very much. Mm -hmm. You helped him at Sakura Gaoka. Oh, I remember. He was so excited when he told me. He now aspires to grow strong and brave, just like you. It was nothing, really. <laughs> so, what brings you here? Well, I have a letter I'd like you to translate. Okay. Reversed kanji. Reversed? Yes, but they aren't just reversed left to right. They're written in a special style. Could you read it for me? Yes, of course. Beware of those who pursue the mirror. If you ever need help, seek the aid of Master Chen. Ju Yuan Da. Ju Yong Da. Master Chen? Oh, there's something written on the back, too. Tian Ji Fu, Jiao Tao Long, Ti Ji Mu, Wo Da Yo. What does it mean? Father's Heaven, Nine Dragons, Mother's Earth, Comrades. I'm sorry, it doesn't make sense. I understand. But I think this part may be a phone number. These ancient characters are numbers. A phone number? Yes. 04686156. Zero four six eight six one five six four seven, right? I've got it. Thank you very much. I guess we have to call Master Chen. It says call, use the phone at blank, but there's phones pretty much all over this town. Like there's one way at the end of the street at the tobacco shop. Wait, hold on, I want to talk to the woman first. Hi, Hirata-san. Ryo. <laughs> Is that it? Alright. I don't think you even need to write 0468. If you just write the rest of it, I think it pretty much skips all of that. Uh, I'm just gonna do it just cuz Hello? Father's heaven. 
Nine dragons. Mother's Earth. Comrades. Warehouse number eight. Warehouse number eight? You. Who are you? Isn't this the Chen residence? Oops. That's warehouse number eight. Hi, Hirata-san. Oh, hello, Ryo. Do you know where warehouse number eight is? What? Firehouse number eight? No, warehouse number eight. Hmm. Don't believe I've ever heard of it before. I have the phone number, but... Well then, why don't you try looking in the phone book? The address might be listed. Yeah. There's a phone book right here. Come on, let me look at it. Sixty-one. Sixty-one. Got it. Sixty-one. It's in Amihama. Alternatively, I think you can call number assistance and they'll tell you where it is. Excuse me. Yes? Which way is Amihama? Amihama? That's the harbor. Harbor? I haven't gone there in a while, but if you turn right onto the main street, there's a bus that goes there. Actually, you know what? I don't think Where I even Amihama? need to go to the arcade. That would be the harbor. That was just a there's setup. There's a bus stop. Thank you. But I'll... Uh, nah. Yeah, I don't think there's any anything there. What time did the buses come? Weekday. What day is it today? Oh, wait. It's every 30 minutes. It's a Sunday, so... Uh, is Sunday a holiday? So it's like, it's every hour. The next one is at... Uh... Oh, I just missed it, so I have to wait another 20 minutes. Oh, I don't want to miss it again, I'll just wait. Here we go. Whoop. No, turn around.
All right, that's disc one done. Where the fuck is my game case? I need to switch the discs. All right, that's done. Let me just check if this is still working while this the game loads up. Yeah, it seems to be fine. Oh wait, how much money do I have? It's an important thing that happens, and I don't want to miss it because I have too little money. Alright, sweet. So, we're at the harbour finally. Oh, this is a cool. Hey, you! I said hand over all your money! Hmm? I don't have no more! Please, leave me be! Huh? No more? Don't mess with me! Stop it! And just who are you? Don't you know that blackmail is way uncool? Thinks you stop it? Eh? New Hazuki from Suka High! <laughs> Hazuki? Yeah? So what? I ain't afraid of him! I can take this geek! You're no match for me! Dorosan! <laughs> hey! Hey, you! Wait! Damn! Whoa! You've had it now! Question. Sure, what is it? Warehouse number eight? Where is it? Yeah, yeah. Down the street, there's a new warehouse district. 
Turn right, and number eight should be there. So it's straight, and to the right. That's it. Well, uh, time for us to go. Yeah, that cutscene had some of the fucking most hilarious dialogue in this game. Don't you know that blackmail is way uncool? Fucking, how could anyone let that through? How much money? Yeah, alright, I should have enough. He's Akasa. We are. I need to go to warehouse number eight, but. Oh, number eight? It's right behind here. Do you have some business at the warehouse? Well, sort of. So it's right behind here. Thanks a lot. Thanks a lot. It's right here. See the big number eight? Hey, you! Hey, you're not authorized! Get out now! That's completely wrong voice for that guy. I wonder if there's another way Should in. Should be that gruff old man voice. Why is he like, Hey you, get out of here. So, we have to find a way to sneak into warehouse number 8. And, uh, conveniently, there's a box here that I can push. After I trigger this. Hold on. Are you fucking serious? There we go. An open window. I'll need to boost myself up there. There must be some information here. This looks like an office. That's pretty cool. These cigarettes? This won't be of any help. Aw oh, man. We could have stolen them. What's this? An invoice for warehouse number eight? This must be the right place. <laughs> Alright, get me out of this room. Is someone there? When you look at this invoice, the address is wrong. So it is. I've asked them a million times to get it right. Yeah, it says right here, Old Warehouse District. What are they thinking? Can you call over to the old warehouse number eight? Okay, got it. So there's another warehouse number eight. I'll need to find the old warehouse district. This must be the right place. Except it isn't. Huh. 
Someone move that box. Oh, this guy's just taking a shit down there. It's fine. What happens at the harbor stays at the harbor. There's a specific cutscene I want to trigger. But I think I. Yeah, here we go. I keep telling you, stay out of here. How'd that bum get in here anyway? No idea. Are you all right? Yeah. Young man, sure's a cold day, eh? Don't suppose you'd buy an old man a can of coffee, eh? Let's be nice to the old man. Because, uh... He's probably going to help us some some time down the road. That's what that's what the game told me. Buy drinks for people and they'll help you. Four twenty. Four twenty money. I guess I'll take this over to him. Here. Oh. Oh. That's so warm. You're <laughs> not even gonna drink it? Much obliged, young man. Mister, where do you live? In this here harbor. Long about three years, I reckon. Really? Well, Take care of yourself. That was a that was a real like Yakuza camera angle. I mean the games, not the actual organized crime. So yeah, uh fuck it. Oh wait wait, yeah, yeah. <laughs> I forgot. I'm gonna go talk to what's her face. And then she'll tell me about something. And that will eventually lead me to doing something. Hopefully if I haven't missed it. Hisakasa. Well. I need to get to the old warehouse district, but the old warehouse district. It's just up the street. Great. Thank you very much. Oh, I think I missed the trigger. Shit, alright. I'm gonna go to where it is anyway, in case I accidentally run into that cutscene. Cause it's a pretty cool cutscene. Nah, I think I, I think I fucked up. Yeah. All right. Well, I might as well go. Find the old warehouse district then. Just up this this path. What 
Tom's here as well. Tom. Hi, Dio. Have you heard of the old warehouse district? The old warehouse district? No, never heard of it, man. Really? Do you know anyone who might know about it? Maybe Hisaka-san can help you. Hisaka-san? She sells lunch boxes near the warehouses. She's way over there. I see. I'll ask her. I already did that, man. What's wrong with you? But maybe this will trigger the cutscene. I really want that cutscene, okay? Stop judging me. Hisakusa. What is it? About the old warehouse district. Oh, it's a bit far. It's that way. Thank you very much. I've got to go. I'll stop by later. Oh yeah, well. Hey, wait! You can't get in without authorization. Go on, get out! Why does everyone need authorization to do everything in here? Gotta wait till tonight. So yeah, we gotta wait until the night. Honey-san. Hi, Nyo. Um... I see you're working hard as usual. How about a cup of coffee? Sorry, maybe next time. Trying to sell your wares Tom. to me. I know hey, you're tricks Leo. for me. How's everything? I'm always chilling. If you ever need help, just ask me, okay? Thanks. I like Tom's shirt, by the way. It's got the, uh... I can't look at it. <laughs> Alright. Maybe if I get behind him. See, it's got, it's got him on it, sort of. Whatever, anyway. So yeah, he's a tomato mark. In case you missed darts, we can play darts again. He's probably going to say that he shouldn't because there's a because he won't have enough money to go. On. Excuse me. Scala, I think she's like yes. a foreign exchange student or something. Do you know anything about she the speaks really weird and district? I think it's this you time it's intentional. There aren't any decent looking men there. You don't say. The security guards are crude and nasty, always staring at my ass when I walk by. Once when I stopped near oh, the entrance to read a sign, one said, Stop looking, move on. Is that so? Well perv. Fucking telling you to stop looking. Uh, wait, are they the Dreamcast? No. I don't think these. No, which one was it? Or maybe it's just in a random darts. one. One game, 100 yen. Whatever. I'm gonna play darts. I'll give it a try. No, okay, I have enough.
No, good. What the, what the fuck? I totally, I totally don't know how to judge the distance in this one. I'm getting it. Here we go. How does the game know that you completely missed the dartboard? Yeah. Does it have, does it have like signals or like sensors on the outside of the dartboard? All right. Oh, does that count? Oh yeah, it does. Last one. How's the high score? Fifty. Ah, All fuck right. It. Oh wait, I got it. Yeah. The best. I got zero Come score. Over. That's enough for no, now. I'm not playing that again. That took like five seconds. Excuse me. I'm sorry. Ask me again some other time. There are three vending machines in here. It's a bit overkill if you ask me. I don't know, I'm just saying dumb shit now. It's almost seven though. I think I have to wait until like ten or something. I'm just gonna stand here and watch this dude. No, never mind. I can do it right now. So I'm gonna purposefully. Um, Fuck this up. No, just a few times, so just to waste a couple of days because it skips, it skips forward the day every time you fuck up. So I'm gonna get a bunch of extra money and day experience. Uh, hello. What? Uh, whoops. Huh? What's that noise? Just the wind? Uh, hello? What? Uh, whoops. Huh? What's that noise? Just the wind? Just the wind? Uh, hello? What? Uh, whoops. Huh? What's that noise? Just the wind? Just the wind? Uh, hello? What? Uh, whoops. Huh? What's that noise? 
Just the wind? the wind uh, hello what uh, whoops huh what's that noise just the wind Just the wind? Uh, hello? What? Uh, whoops. Huh? What's that noise? Just the wind? Just the wind? Keep going and this will be the last one actually. Uh, hello. What? Uh, whoops. Huh? What's that noise? Just the wind? This guy thinks it's the wind every night. Doesn't he think it's think it's suspicious that it happens every single night? I wasn't paying attention to which way I was supposed to press, so I guess I'll have to react. Get it. Close. Okay, now's my chance. Huh? There's some writing. Alright, so this is tactical Warehouse espionage action. No, not here. We have to do stealth missions in Shenmu. I hope I don't fuck this up because I guards. wasted all those I days already. Me. If you fuck this up too many times, the uh the old man, the old man, homeless dude, comes and gives you a map. And then if you fuck it up too many hey times you. again. What are you doing? Oh shit, I fucked it up. <laughs> I don't you? know if there's any way to Serves actually lose him. Right. Oh man. I hope I don't fucking accidentally go past Christmas. So anyway, said, if you fuck out, it up too many it? times again, the old man draws all the guard positions and their routes on your map. So it's like, come on, dude, what, how, you, how are you gonna fuck this up this many times? It's no good. I'll try again tomorrow. Yeah, you 
caught Metal Gear Solid 2, did the whole peering over around corners thing first. Now it's Shenmue Dark. Yes, this is warehouse number eight. I once went right up to the door and then got seen by a guard, and then I was like, fuck, and I had to miss a whole day. So anyway, we're in warehouse number eight. We'll go look around now. Pretty creepy music. Look at all this shit going on. Go look at this plate, I think, to trigger the car. Uh, who's there? This says, if you ever need help, seek the aid of Master Chen. May I look at the letter? Sure. Yes, this is Zhu's handwriting. But it appears this letter arrived too late. Yes. This is Zhu Yonda. How does he know my father? You and your father brought back a certain mirror from China. The mirror? The one that man stole? It was stolen? Yes. The man who killed my father, Lan Di. Lan Di. Do you know him? Well, I know of him. An organization called Qi Yo Min. Its leader goes by that name. I hear he's a master of a deadly martial art. Yes, he used a style I've never seen. I think we mean the same person. What does this mean? Please tell me why my father... You needn't tell this boy anything, father. Father? No, I'm bound by my promise to Ju and Da regarding this boy's father. But... but... Was only one mirror stolen? Huh. I'm asking if only one mirror was stolen. Yes, made of stone, a dragon design. If so, then there's one more. I believe the Phoenix Mirror. Phoenix? A mythical bird of Chinese legend that guards human life. That mirror? My house? Perhaps. Find it, and then we'll talk. Yes, when I do, I'll return. From now on, telephone beforehand. And remember the password. didn't even let me save so yeah, now we have to find the Phoenix mirror which is somewhere in the house but before that I'm gonna save and uh, take a bathroom break
Alright, I'm back. So anyway, Phoenix Mirror, we have to find it somewhere. It's somewhere in the house, somewhere. Maybe that sword I found yesterday has, or the, well, it was like two weeks ago, in game time, but maybe that sword has something to do with it. How much money do I have? Today's allowance. Holy shit! <laughs> Alright. Oh, dude, I should fucking check my moves. Oh my god, they're all like upgrading and shit. I'm gonna set a. Uh, what should I set R to? I swear I did these on someone. Uh, I'm gonna set R to that. Turn down the volume again. It's probably getting picked up. All right, so Phoenix Mirror, somewhere in the house. Think I'll warm up a bit. Nah. Can't reach it. Yeah, so this is what I was trying to do the other day. I forgot you had to be on disc too. What's this? But there's a hidden wall scroll here. Not wall scroll, a move scroll. What the fuck am I talking about? What's this doing here? Sword. Yeah. I'll leave I don't this need here. it. <laughs> so I just picked it up for no reason. So I know exactly what I'm supposed to do. But I wanna I don't wanna say it to leave a little bit of a mystery until we find it. Actually I don't know exactly what I'm supposed to do, but I know there's something that triggers something that I need before I can find the thing. And I need to find Ine san. Is she in the kitchen? Yes yeah, she is. Um Ine san? Yes, what is it? Well, about that day, have you remembered anything? No, and I do not want to think about it. I get chills thinking about it even now. Oh. By the way, Fukuhara-san was looking for you. Huh? Fukuhara-san is? So where the fuck is he if he's not in dojo? That cat is probably starved to death, by the way, since it's been like 10 days since I've fed it. There was no in his room. Don't tell me he's magically spawned in the dojo. Oh, it's probably fucking... That's probably triggered a cutscene outside or something.
There he is. Folks on. Huh? Um, real son, I. What is it, Folks on? I'm sorry. I told Ine san. What did you tell her? I told her what you're doing. I told her everything I know. You what? You fucking I also. Just couldn't help myself. And Inesan needed to know. Fuxa. I'm really sorry. It's okay. Fuxa, do you know anything about the Phoenix it's not Mirror? Okay. The Phoenix Mirror? My father may have had it. No. I've never heard him say anything about a mirror. Really? Inesan might know something about it though. Okay. Let's go ask her. Ah, Inesan. Fukusan talks very loud, doesn't he? Huh? I just heard the two of you talking. We were talking? Yes, I'm sorry. It was rude of me to eavesdrop. Oh, it's okay. No, it wasn't. But then, who could tell the son of Iwao Hazuki to stay out of trouble? I hate to say it, but... I feel like I'm letting your father down. I... I'm sorry for making you worry so much. Dear son, I don't know if this will help or not. But there was one thing I recall. It wasn't that long ago when... Azuki sensei went to an antique shop to have something stored for him. My father did what? I don't know what it was, but he said it was very important. Antique shop. So now that we know we have a lead, we can go to that antique shop. But first I want to stop off and feed that cat, just cause. It's like the 22nd of December, right? Christmas is just around the corner. Oh shit. The cat's legs healed. You and I have a lot in common. Our parents died on the same day. Ryo. Oh, Nozomi. What were you talking about? Nothing. You always say nothing. You never tell me anything anymore. It's not like that. It's just... I understand. But you need to talk to me, okay? Okay. Take care of yourself. See ya. So anyway, before I was so rudely, rudely interrupted. Ah, uh, doesn't that feel good? Chibi, you okay? <laughs> hey, see you soon. Here, eat it. It's tasty. Seems you were hungry, huh? You're so hungry, man. He, he hasn't eaten in 10 days.
Uh, yeah, the antique shop. I forgot what I was supposed to do. For a second. Excuse me. Merry Christmas! Ho, ho, ho! Yes? What is it? Do you know where the antique shop is? If you mean Bukado Antique Shop, it's across from Hoku Hoku Lunches. Thanks. Hoku Hoku Lunches. Thanks, Santa. <laughs> What a nice guy. Excuse me. It's a delightful sound, don't you agree? It was made especially for that butterfly woman. You know Madame Butterfly, don't you? You, your Hazuki Sensei's... Oh my, that was a terrible thing, your father. Ah! I was holding something at Sensei's request. Hmm, just where did I put it, huh? Oh, yes, it was very important, so I put it here. He'd asked me to polish and look after it for him. For my father? It's given to the Hazuki heirs once they turn 18. I gather this antique has been passed down from generation to generation. Father. If there's anything I can do for you, please let me know. Hazuki Sensei was always there for me when I needed him. Was there anything else that he asked you to hold for him? Anything else? Like a mirror, called the Phoenix Mirror. A Phoenix Mirror? Hmm... Sorry, I don't know of any mirror. Well, that's okay. Thank you very much. So yeah, now that we have a sword handguard, we can try putting it on that sword back at the house. What the fuck? Why did he turn around? Oh. 
No way. You're working with Landy? If I was. Why, you... If I continue, then I'll fail as your bodyguard. A bodyguard? Father told me to guard you. What? Calm down. If you don't live, it'll be a problem for us. What you mean? You still don't realize your role, do you? If Landi gets that mirror, no one can stop him. Hurry and find that mirror. Before they suspect anything. <laughs> Landy Sama, the Phoenix Mirror? <laughs> <laughs> so anyway back to the uh, search for the phoenix mirror Oh hey uh Arba, what's up? You missed quite a lot actually. We're on disc two now. And uh we're looking for the Phoenix mirror at the moment. We went to the what harbour time? and we did a bunch of stuff. Yes. This was at the antique shop for me. Let's see. It's a sword handguard. Yeah. It was my father's. It's a part of my inheritance. I see. Have you seen this before? Like this design? It might yeah, be a family crest. I've been for like an hour and a Have half you asked now, so. No, not yet. Well, you should ask her. You're right. I think she's in the altar room. Thanks. Oh yeah, the altar room. I should like pray to my father for guidance or some shit. Also, it's uh, I skipped ten days, so we're on December twenty second now. It's almost Christmas. Oh, we met Santa as well. That was cool. Well, no, I'm not even joking. By the way. This was at the antique shop. A sword handguard. Inesan, do you know anything about this? The snow ring, the two stars, and a sword. That's the Hazuki family crest. 
And that mirror you're looking for, I wonder if there's a connection. Maybe your father left us a clue. Snow ring, two stars, one sword. Thanks. Hey man, you'd be surprised how far you can get in fighting games with just a regular uh, controller. You don't need a an arcade stick to be good. I mean, I have one, but you know. I just like it, so. Where's the Phoenix Mirror? Yeah, I get you. I'm more comfortable with sticks as well. Especially for like Guilty Gear. I can't use the D-pad on that. It breaks my thumb. Especially the PS2 D-pad. It's fucking... It's harder than diamonds, dude. So anyway, we found we've got the sword hand guard. We're gonna put it on the sword right here. Why does the sword have no hand guard? <laughs> Good question, man. Maybe we should put it on there. Oh, there it is. Is this handguard for this sword? No. Doesn't fit. Uh, yeah, they still make fight sticks for current gen systems. If you make, if you mean PS4 and Xbox One, then yeah. Uh, the uh, Mad Cat's TE2 is like the uh, the what's it called? The standard, I guess. Whatever. Anyway, we've got to look at this. Take these down. Why is that here? What's this slot for? What the fuck? Okay. I accidentally pressed A there. But why is a sword with no handguard in this box? No glory. Huh? That shape. Why is that here? So we gotta stick this thing in the slot, and we gotta stick the sword in the other slot. By the way, that uh, okay. little chest thing that we found the key for the sword in, that had the crest on it as well. Oh, wait, I just need to press A. A switch. Ah. 
Ouch. I wonder where this leads. Oh man, it's pretty dark in here. It's a good thing I found this flashlight earlier. Starving eagle never steals. Like my father always said, never cheat even during a struggle. So there's more matches here in case you these missed are all some. Dried out. You can you can buy these at the shop, by the way, at the tomato mart. In case you don't find them around the house. You can just like buy them. The stab armor. It looks like the name of a move. Oh yeah, Arbo, oh, check out how much money we have. That's three thousand yen right there. I can still use it. of eternal youth. I remember my father telling me about it being used by martial arts experts in China. Where did father get this? Elixir of eternal youth. I better put it back. Shit. Elixir of eternal youth. Hey man, $25 youth. is a lot when you're 17. Me about it being used and you don't by have a job. Experts in China. Where did father get this? I'm sure there's something down there, but I can't see it at the moment. What strange paper. It doesn't look Japanese at all. Where did father get this? It's father when he was young. But who's that with him? I can still use it. Uh... What the fuck? Let me light the candle. There we go. I don't know why that went all weird earlier. Hey, regardless, it's that just means we have a lot of money for capsule toys, alright? We can get yeah, like 25 capsule toys. Or, well, we can get 31 capsule toys. Something's inside. It says good luck. Some kind of amulet? What an unusual shape. 
It's probably not from Japan. Okay, that's a book. Who's holding the flashlight? It's a paperweight. Oh yeah, I should, uh, should uh, check those scrolls I can't read Chinese. This one is also in Chinese, I guess. There's nothing else in here. I wonder if there are any clues here. Say oh, it's a, an arm move or a leg move or anything, and he didn't. I didn't get the like pop up thing, so it must be in Chinese. It says, "All good deeds shall be rewarded." Did my father write it? It's our family crest, a sake cup. Does this have something to do with my family? Uh, I don't know what that middle kana is, but I think that's no. That's no something no. Hachiri-san? Some kind of medicine? It looks pretty old. Maybe my father used it. There's something down there. I want to look at the bombshells. Oh, it's a face. All right. That wasn't clear. There's something definitely down there. I'm going to look at it eventually. There we go. It's a ball. It's beautiful. But why is it here? It's beautiful. I wonder who used it. I can still use it. Oh, here's a candle. I can still use it. Even though it's like a hundred years old, it's still usable.
Oh, the wait. candle's gone out. Do I have a light bulb? I don't have a light bulb. All right. If you have a light bulb, you can like turn the electric on. I didn't buy one, so. No, okay, there's nothing there. I can use it if I have a candle. I've never seen a weapon like this. That's some ninja shit, yo. Yeah, okay. Let's just do what we're supposed to. No, okay, that's nothing. Hmm. What's that? Hey, it looks like a talisman. What could that talisman mean? Okay. Hold on. These scratches must be from the shells. Dude, careful man, you're going to get foot trapped. I wonder if it's a sign. This, it seems to be sealed. Huh? That wall, the color's slightly different. Hmm. You know what slightly different colored walls means? Different sounds. It means you can bomb this it. Is it. Can I break the wall with this axe? <laughs> ha! That was weak. Yeah. This is the Hazuki family crest. This box. Got it. Oh my god. It's the Phoenix Mirror. It's the Phoenix Mirror. Well, finally found it. Time to go show it to everyone, everyone around town and brag about how, how much of a cool guy I am. Ryo-san, you found the mirror? Yeah, so the, the reflection part mirror? is on the other side. It's kind of creepy, eh? I feel like it's pulling me in. Real, real sign. Oh, this Stop dream it, car, so please. Can't actually reflect anything. You think it could be cursed? No, 
I don't think it's cursed. Uh -huh. I have a feeling about it, but I can't explain. Hey, see what I mean? That's dangerous! Are you possessed? Folks, uh, get real, would you? What? I'm serious! Fuck him, Fuxa. Enough. Give me some time alone, okay? Uh, sure. I need some alone time with this mirror. I should take this mirror to Master Chen. Yeah, I think it's too late to actually go to Master Chen right now. So, I'll go there tomorrow, I guess. By the way, uh, Arbor, the uh, the cat's leg is uh, healed, so it's fine now. Cat's not gonna run away. We feed it every day. All right. So see you there, Arba. How long do you think you're gonna take? To be honest, I'll probably. By the time you get back, it'll probably just be tomorrow. You know what, I, we, have, we still have a lot of the game left to go. I'm only on disc two, like the beginning of disc two. Hello. Oh, Hazuki-san. Thanks for your help the other day. But can I ask for your help with one more thing? What is it? It's about this mirror. Can you tell me anything about it? Let me see it. This is a very unusual mirror. It's called the Phoenix Mirror. Phoenix. In China, the Phoenix is the legendary bird of fortune. It's a guardian for the Sky Lord. Guardian? The other guardian is the dragon. A dragon? In China, people consider the North Star to be the Lord of the Sky. Look there. That is an old Chinese map in stone, see? It's a map of the Big Dipper from the Han Dynasty. On a moonless night. Should you pray to the stars, your wishes shall be realized. The Big Dipper revolves around the immovable North Star. In China, the North Star is highly respected. For ages and ages, people have worshipped it. In China, there are numerous fascinating legends about the stars. I see. Thank you very much. You're welcome.
Yeah, I didn't know you could actually show the pe- people the mirror and they'll tell you stories about it, like backstory on it, until like my fifth playthrough of the game. This game has so many like intricate secrets that you you never just know. You have to just like experiment and find out. Son. Yes? Have you been busy lately? Well, a little. Do you want something to eat? No thanks. I was just passing by. We'll treat you. No thanks. I'll come again. We'll be looking forward to it. Tao san. What is it? Would you like some food? Have some ramen. I'll give a really big portion. No thanks, I'm in a rush. Okay, I'll be waiting. Excuse me. Oh, Hazuki Sensei's boy. I could really use your expertise again. Of course, provided it's something I am familiar with. Is it about the sword handguard from the other day? No, it's about this. Hmm, may I take a look? What a marvelous stone phoenix mirror. Stone mirrors were produced in China during ancient times. This is an exceptional piece. Is there anything unusual about this one? Indeed there is. I think perhaps this type of precious stone is only found in the Guilin region. Precious stone? According to a book I once read long ago, an emperor ordered a sculptor from Guilin to engrave a guardian onto a stone mirror. Guardian? The phoenix on this mirror is a guardian. Is there any connection between the phoenix and the stone from Guilin? Well, I really can't speculate, but... Considering the legend associated with this mirror, undoubtedly there is a connection. I see. Well then. Thank you very much for your help. You're welcome. Uh, I'm not exactly sure where else there is to go now. To ask about the mirror specifically. Maybe if I go to the barbers, I don't know. Excuse me. It's Santa Merry again. Merry Christmas! Ho ho ho! Oh, hello there. How about the genuine Italian flavor at Bob's Pizzeria? Or unwind and have some fun at the slot house. Some other time. Oh yeah, completely forgot about the fucking slot machine in this game. 
Yeah, it's just it's just a slot machine. There's nothing interesting about it. However, uh, the machines are numbered, and if you go to the fortune teller, she'll tell you the lucky your lucky number for that day. So you have a slightly better chance of winning. And that's the strats for beating the slot machine. Nozomi. So, let's talk to Nozomi. Take care. Sure. I right, see ya. <laughs> Wasn't that fun? What is this again? Yeah, here we go. That's the fortune teller. And it's the giant shop. Let's see what we're trying to Oh, it's closed. It's closed. Right. Let me go. Whoops. Let's go store time until I'll oh, come back. I don't want him to miss out on anything else. Whoops. I accidentally kicked the mic. You know what, I'm gonna go play dolls again. Oh hey, you're back. Okay. I was gonna I was gonna waste some time until you came back, but it's okay. I love these. Maybe just one. Huh? Okay, this time I got a black die. What a great investment. Dice two. Maybe I should get another. Nah, not nah, today. By the way, Arbor, how's the uh, the audio balancing? Because I watched the uh, vi the video of my last stream, and I could hear the game echoing. And I was kind of annoyed that you didn't tell me, <laughs> to be honest, but whatever. I didn't ask you, so it's fine. It's fine? Alright. Can you hear me fine over the game, though? So the echo is gone this time, right? But I care, man. It's important. This is supposed to be a professional stream where I accept donations and shit. Where's my sub button? Twitch, please. Alright, cool. If the echo's gone, that's fine. My TV is like super quiet, so. You know, I, can't, I can barely hear anything. Where's the. 
Who's a chip face emote? I need a, you know, sushi, kabuki, banzai. Where's the jam emote? I need some more abunai in my life. Aru. I don't know what the fuck I'm talking about. You know what? Today, let's turn off the light. Save energy, innit? Save the planet. This is the 80s. No one knew about that shit. Or did they? I don't know. Enid sign is always there for me. Yeah, he. Chip, uh. Does that. You, uh. The Fru04. What have you noticed? What's coming? Uh, I'll be out. Uh, in the Japanese version, he speaks like, uh, what's the Japanese equivalent of English? He does that. Because he's supposed to be like a, an actual weeaboo in the story. So he's like, Shogun! And shit. And he says all kinds of weird Japanese words while he's fighting. I forgot I need to call Master Chen, that's why I'm coming back in. Well, I mean, he speaks like normal Japanese as well because it's a Japanese game, but he needs a. Uh, well, he. During his moves, he does. He just speaks random Japanese words. And it, when he speaks Japanese, he kind of has an accent as well. Hello? Father's heaven. Nine dragons. Mother's earth. Comrades. Warehouse number eight. Master Chen, please. Excuse me, but you are... My name is Hazuki. Just a moment. What is it? Yeah, I found the mirror. I'll tell my father. Come to warehouse number eight. Sure. You're never safe from the weeaboos, man. They're, they'll invade your life. They're invading Japan right now. Hi, Megumi. Hi, Adele. Look, Adele, she's licking her fur. She's grooming herself. What's grooming? That means she is cleaning herself. By Real, please her don't fur. talk about grooming to children. I see. You're still so tiny. Chibi, you look well. <laughs> You're so cute. Want some food? I think she likes this food. It must taste good. I'll bring more again soon. Great! Thank you, dear.
Dude. Excuse me. Oh, but do, yes? you, do you understand how cool this game is? You have to actually wait for the bus. It's so fucking realistic. We have to wait a whole 15 minutes for the bus because it's on a schedule. Also, this girl, I think we see her at the harbor later. So it's like proper continuity in it. Oh, whoops. Oh, I might as well just wait for the bus now. <laughs> You're right through. Here we go, it's the bus. Look, he actually waits for the other people to get on first because he's a cool guy. Uh, yeah, okay. Let me just go back and check one more time if I can trigger that cutscene. This is the last time I'm gonna check. Easier to hide a rod behind PPP instead of in front. What are you talking about? I need to go to warehouse number eight. I have an appointment with Master Chen. What's your name? Yo, Hazuki. I've been expecting you, sir. Please, go on in. Oh, people, all right. I still, know, still don't know what the rod refer, refers to, though. I think she's talking about a penis. In which case, that's weird. Don't worry, I figured it out, never mind. <laughs> So it's a cutscene, so I'm gonna sh Ah, the Phoenix Mirror. Yes, it's made of Phantom River Stone. Why did Landy only steal the Dragon Mirror? He probably didn't realize your father had both of them. Two mirrors. A long time ago, Chu Yuan Da once told me, when the dragon and the phoenix meet, the gates of heaven and earth will open, and Chi Yu will resurrect itself on earth. Chi Yu? It's a legendary Chinese monster that will devour this world of ours. It appears Lan Di will try to make use of both mirrors. What will he try? 
that even I don't know. But you mustn't allow him to get that mirror. Be careful and stay alert. If he finds that mirror, it will be the end of you. Huh? What the? Hey! Two mirrors! Landy Sama will be pleased! Wei uh, Cheng! Oh! Hazuki! Push that button! Thanks. Is it the work of the Mad Angels? Mad Angels? We always have trouble with that gang. Those are dirty bastards. That thing was probably connected to the Chi Yo Men. The Chi Yo Men? Yes, the Chi Yo Men and Mad Angels are linked. Perhaps they are the ones who guided Lan Di here. So, if I find the Mad Angels, I'll find Lan Di. Nah, he's likely not here anymore. Then where did he go? Well, maybe he has already gone to Hong Kong. Hong Kong? I have a request. Request? What is it? Please help me get to Hong Kong. If so, then what? I'll find Lan Di. And then? And then, he'll kill you. He's too strong. What did you say? Stop it! I must avenge my father's murder. Huh. How admirable. But you don't stand a chance. Well, if it was you... Suppose your father was murdered, what would you do? Please, help me! I'm sorry, but I can't. Let's go, Kui Chang. Master Chen, please wait! You should not waste your life on revenge. So, the Chi Yo men? And Landi? Seems he left for Hong Kong. Hong Kong? A flong of Hong Kong? Also through, I'm glad to know you have a small dick. That's like the only thing I know about you. Do you normally introduce yourself by saying facts about your penis?
Oh man, it's Christmas Eve. What did I get as a present? Guess Hong Kong's out. Now we got some real money. I got literally nothing for my birthday. Oh, not my birthday, Christmas. Puxa, you know of any cheap travel agencies? Yeah, there's one in Dabuita, but... Dabuita, hmm. Why you wanna know? I'm thinking of going to Hong Kong. Huh? Hong Kong? Yeah, it appears that Landy went there. But what, what will you tell Ine-san? I'll persuade her. Not alone, you won't. I'll help you. Ine-san, do you have a minute? Yes, what is it? I know it's sudden, but I'm thinking of going on a trip. A trip? Yes. <laughs> Good. You could use a vacation. Oh, yeah. Where are you thinking of going? Hong Kong! Hong Kong? Fuxa. It seems the man who killed Hansuki-sensei is there. Ine-san, please give him the money for the trip. Idiot. What are you planning to do, Ryo-san? Oh, nothing. Nothing? This is crazy. I can't let you do this. Well, he has to get there somehow, Ine-san. I'm not listening. ine -san. End of discussion. Uh, uh, huh? Thanks a lot. What? What did I do? You didn't have to tell her everything. Uh, I'm sorry. I'm going to have to do this by myself. Fuxan is such a fucking asshole. He ruins everything. Like, I don't even know why I'm friends with him. Inexan is always there for me. Except when I need money to go to Hong Kong. All right, see ya, bro. This is probably the last day anyway. Some shit's gonna go down though. She... she was already oh, gone shit. when I came. Will she come back? Okay. I'll go find her and you wait here, Megumi. Thanks so much, Do.
Alright, sorry about that. I have to take a phone call. Hmm. It must be that kitten. She's close. Maybe down there. Don't look there. Come on. Well, there you are. Ah, oh, there. Nozomi. Real wait. Were you looking for her too? Yeah. She's here, Megumi. Oh, really? Chibi, Chibi. Where have you been? I was worried. Great, huh? Yep. Thanks a lot, Nozomi. No, not me. Ryo found her. Thanks a lot, Ryo. No problem. Well, I gotta go meet my friend. See ya. Yeah. Actually, you know what? I think Eat I'm gonna it. it's tasty. leave it here for today. I'll go back to Rio's room and save and quit. It must taste good. I'll bring more again soon. Great! Thank you, Dio. This game's not as fun without Arbo here, being my co-pilot. No, but seriously, I'm tired. It's like past midnight right now. I've been going for like two and a half hours. Alright, uh, until next time.